Well, let's see how it all went down. Dwight Freeney, the most watched ankle in uh, the entire week. We he told would, you no, he would won. play. He went. He missed a Super Bowl. He would go. Drew Brees and Peyton Manning, the first ever matchup of 4,000 yard quarterbacks in a Super Bowl. Opening possession of the Colts after the Saints went three and out. Peyton Manning was dissecting that Saints defense to start things off. After a Dallas Clark reception three plays later, there's Austin Colley 14 yards. There's the first blitz of the game right there, and they hit Austin Colley for a big first down. Three plays later, third and five from right at the red zone. Manning looking for Pierre Garcon, but just out of reach. Colts settle for a field goal and draw. First blood, 3-0. The Saints don't score again. Colts get the ball back. Second and 10 from their own 15. Joseph Adai had a good night, Mike. Uh, Joseph Adai was averaging early on about 8 yards per carry. It looks like the Saints were ready for pass, but they were, Colts were able to run. Oh, good play call by Peyton Manning, changing the play at the line of scrimmage. And then three plays later, third and one from right around midfield. Here is Joseph Adai getting the first down and then some. Longest run of the game by anybody, 26 yards. Did you see what he just did to Darren Sharper? Great move. We always say Darren Sharper is a great guy to second. Oh, oh, but I don't know about that tackling wow. on that play. But we got to give a guy some credit. He ran effective tonight. And then three plays later, we got our first touchdown of the game on third and six. Peyton, Peyton Manning, nice throw to Pierre Garçon. Soon as one player went down, the quarterback went down for the Saints. Peyton Manning went right to the replacement. Uh, and scores this touchdown. Look at the set. The set was a great setup. Moshi well, used great feet, got off the jam and stayed inside and stacked him over top. A 96-yard drive, tying the longest drive in Super Bowl history, lasted 11 plays. Now the Saints are down 10, needing some points in a hurry to stop the momentum from wearing a blue shirt. And then Drew Blees finds Marcus Colston down to the Colts 29. Three plays later, 10th play of the drive, third and three. Here's Dwight Freeney. What a nice ball rush right there. Yes, he looked fresh early in the game. Now, this was his only sack. You can see a couple plays before that. He had a spin move. This one was a bull rush, and he gets there for his only sack. It was the only sack of the game for the uh, Indianapolis Colts. Sixth play of the next possession of the Saints. Here's Lance Moore, wide open. Nice move. 21-yard game down to the Colts. 23. It's 10-3. Two plays later, second and 17. Marcus Colston, first down, down to the Colts three-yard line. For Marcus Colston to be a big receiver, he runs inside the numbers very well. Very well, Dion. Three plays later, third goal from the one, Mike Bell. Swing slips and falls. That's a loss of a half a yard. Sean Payton, what's he going to do? He can go for the field goal, make it a 10-6 game, get the points, but he decides to go for Why it. Why not? He's got three Pro Bowl offensive linemen to the right side. Go for it! And he goes for it. Oh, comes up with nothing. Gary Brackett, the first one to hit Pierre Thomas, and Clint Session polishes him off. What a big play. He had to push, but it seems like it took too long to get the handoff to the running back. They had to the play block well. But the Saints defense makes the Colts go three and out. And they use their times out to make sure that there's 30 ticks left on the clock. And Breeze finds Jeffrey Henderson. So they get a field goal right before the end of the half. And just when you thought that that had all the wind out of their sails, they come out of oh, the great half. Play. And with the first onside kick in Super Bowl history, before the fourth quarter, Chris Rees recovers for the Saints. What a call and execution. They surprised him on this, and the Colt defender had a chance to catch this onside kick. But it doinks off his helmet, and the Saints recover after about a 30-second fight for the ball. A real fight at the bottom of that pile. You know they were scrambling for that football but I like the way the kicker came up to swing his leg like it was a full kick but he did not make a full kick so the Florida Lee with some momentum now again they got a field goal at the end of the half after getting nothing on fourth and goal first play after the onside kick to start the second half here Thomas then Debrie Henderson they're inside the Colts 40 two plays later breeze to Marcus Colston Nine yards more, they're on the cusp of the red zone. As it was a play that they kept running. They kept hitting Coates right in the middle of that zone defense. And then two plays after that, dump it off to Pierre Thomas, and yeah. he does the rest. Fox two halfback screen strong here. That's a touchdown for the Saints, and it was one less possession for the Colts. That was huge to start the second half. Saints' first lead ever in a Super Bowl, up 13-10, but old Peyton Manning is putting his chin strap back together on his helmet. Six plays later, Dallas Clark. What a gorgeous throw. Yeah, Peyton got
got out of the pocket a couple times to the right and threw beautifully from the run. I got to look at that again. You got to see that again. Not only the throw, let's look at the route. Standing straight up, giving him a great length to throw the ball, and only Peyton Manning can stick it in like he did. So the next play. Three plays later, ninth play of the drive, third and five. Manning all sorts of time as Clark again down to the four-yard line. And the very next play, Manning hands it off to Joseph Adai. And we have a touchdown at Super Bowl 44 Break by somebody tackle. not named Pierre. <laughs> In the end zone, Joseph Adai gets a celebration. From Eli Manning up and running well, in the box. Broken tackles. One, two, three. Touchdown. Awesome. That's how you answer Colts after they score a touchdown. Get it right back. 17-13 they lead after a Saints field goal makes it a one-point game. First play of the fourth quarter. Manning Garçon. to Pierre Garçon. 17-yard gain to the Colts. 46. Garçon at 66 yards receiving just like Austin Collie had on the night. Third and 12. Three plays later. Manning to Reggie Wayne. Reggie Wayne, they didn't use him a lot, but he can move the chains a bit, but he ran great routes, and he has to be upset right now. Well, he did come up, we'll talk about that in a moment. He did come up two yards shy right there, and the Colts decide to go for it on fourth down, just on their side of, on the other side of midfield. Nice play with Reggie Wayne right there. Yeah, and you cannot, on a fourth and two, play outside, and you got to get inside and make that receiver take an outside release. Three plays later, third and 11, Austin Collie was the intended receiver, but Jonathan Vilma knocks it away, and they go for a 51-yarder with Matt Stover. Were you surprised about that? I was really surprised because Stover has a right, great kicker, been effective all season long. He had the distance, but pulled it a little bit to the left. And Peyton Manning and the Colts come away with nothing, and they still only cling to a one-point lead. The Saints get the ball in quality field position after the missed field goal from the Colts, 47. Reggie Bush. A 12-yard gain right there. Bush had four rush, had uh, five rushes for 25 yards. Three plays later, Breeze dumps it off to Reggie Bush. He had four catches for 38 yards. I thought yards. they would go for the Reggie Moore because you can't cover him with a linebacker at all. There's David Thomas, a nine-yard gain on second and four down to the Colts. At this Five time. yard line, and then two plays later in the town and where he went to college from the... Do you? Right here in Miami, you get Jeremy Shockey just on a simple slant route, and he makes a great play for a touchdown. They're up five with less than six minutes to go. Oh, the charge says go for two. Lance Moore cannot corral it according to the officials, but Sean Payton believes that is a converted two-point attempt. And sure enough, after further review, Lance Moore gets the ball and creases the plane of the goal, and that is a two-point conversion. Yeah, he must have had good help from the box up top. He's got possession. His butt crosses the goal line with the possession. The ball is over the line, and it gets kicked out of his hands right. late. That's why the official thought it was a bobble, but it was a kick out. That is a two-point conversion. It's a good, good challenge. And how huge is that? Instead of being up five, they're up the full one score of seven with Peyton Manning getting the ball back in a Super Bowl with five and a half minutes to go, and Manning began to go to work all sorts of time finds Pierre Garçon on the other side of the field 17 yard game three plays later fifth play of the drive they're on the same side of the field Reggie Wayne New Orleans native weaving his way through traffic to the Saints 36 three plays later eighth play of the drive just when you thought Manning was going to get this done. Here comes Tracy Porter with the Oh, pick. what a great read. Six, 74 yards the other way. And instead of it being a tie game, the Saints are up two scores in Super Bowl 44 with three minutes and 12 seconds to go. And you heard him right here talk about it, Dion. It's the timing of it. He studied. Remind me a lot of the few times. He knows when to make, a chance, make, make that risk for that big play. He, he just jumped it. When you make a, 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 a play like that, in a time like this, you know study and preparation had to be involved. And that is the way the Port Allen, Louisiana native put his home state team up by two scores over the four-time MVP, Peyton Manning, and the Indianapolis Colts, who get the ball back with time running out on their chance to get a second Super Bowl in four years. But there's Austin Holly free. For 41 yards, how did that happen, Dion? Uh, seam route. The slot corner has to carry the seam. He didn't get the head around. A uh, slight push off. Very effective. And you know Peyton Man is going to put the ball where it needs to be placed. 41-yard gain. So, Manning from the Saints, 30. 
dumps it off to a die after the two-minute warning. A 17-yard gain down to the Saints 13. Four plays later, though, the Saints defense is stiffened enough to make it a fourth goal, fourth and goal attempt. If the Colts don't convert, the game is over, and they don't convert. Reggie Wayne can't bring it in. And Drew Brees and the New Orleans Saints take their very first victory formation in a Super Bowl. Tracy Porter with a pick six of Peyton Manning eventually sealing the deal to make the New Orleans Saints Super Bowl champs for the first time ever. Sean Payton in his fourth year as head coach realizing the dream of so many New Orleanians and so many folks who have been rooting for the Saints waiting for this to happen. Drew Brees with a 32 for 39 night for 288 yards, two touchdowns and no interceptions is the Super Bowl MVP. 31-17 is the final score and as you might imagine, the party is underway in New Orleans.